Hey guys, so in today's video I'm just going to show you how to make a YouTube channel banner. Hopefully you learn how to do it and make sure you like, comment, subscribe and let's get on with the video. So before we start, you want to make sure you have the app Fonto and Pixart, so let's get started. So you want to open the app Fonto, go to the camera icon, press plain image. Press the white image and I'm going to go to that and press custom. Keep the 2048 and change it to 1152. Press done. Press that button and use. Now I'm just going to tap on the picture, add the text, and I'm just going to add my channel name. But first I'm going to choose a font. Now I'm just going to add my channel name, Adventures with Kayla. Now I'm just going to make one for myself. You guys obviously can make your own using your channel's name. And I'm just going to show you how to make the basic one. Now I'm just going to resize it and try to move it to where I want it to be on the banner. And I feel as though it was a bit too small. You want to make it small but not too small so that the person can read it. And I, middle, I put mine in the middle and I did feel as though that was a bit too small. So after I got it correct, I'm going to save the image. Of course, an ad. And then I'm going to go to the app PixArt. Press the plus at the bottom. And press the image that we just create, created. Now I'm going to go to sticker. I'm going to wait for them to load. This is the app that I use for my thumbnails, as you can see. The trigger, the waves, and everything else I use on my unpopular opinions. So just now I press the... Instagram icon and I'm gonna soon get the snapchat icon now what I'm doing now is trying to resize them to make them the same size but I don't want them too big because then it's going to take up a lot of space and right here I was kind of struggling to make the snapchat icon what I wanted it to be And you see how it was giving me a whole bunch of problems, unlike the Instagram icon. It just was not trying to do what I needed it to do. And I'm getting frustrated because it is not turning out how I want it to. Just bear with me, you guys. I will I will eventually get it soon. And see, I'm still trying to make them the same exact size, but I'm still having a bit tad of trouble. But I look like I'm going to get it. Got it. And then what I normally do is I use a line or use a sticker that has a line in it so I can make sure that they're lined up properly. And that they're not crooked. So that's what I'm doing right now. I'm just using the do not copy sticker for the line at the top. So I can make sure that the two icons are leveled correctly. And as you can see, I continuously have to make the do not copy icon small. Because if I try to resize the Instagram or Snapchat icon, it will end up tapping on the do not copy and I will really get frustrated with that. So I have to move it every time I try to resize.
while you're at it, make sure you give this video a thumbs up and subscribe. So I finally got it done. Now I'm just saving it. Now another ad, of course. Now we're just going to go back to the Fonto app and press the image. And we're just going to use the image that we just created. Don't worry about all the pictures that's in my phone. I just take a lot of them. Now, what I'm going to do is, for the Snapchat icon, I'm just going to write my username. Because I really don't remember my username for Snapchat. So, I just wrote username. And I'm just going to change the font because I don't want it the same as my channel name. And I got all these fonts from thefont.com. So if you guys want to get your custom fonts, that's where you go. Now for this one, I'm putting my actual Instagram name. And for some reason, they put a space between that and girl, so I had to change that. As you can see, I am about to do that right now. I'm just going to size it so that it can be, because I don't want it longer than my title the my channel name so I'm making it a bit smaller so it don't be as long it wouldn't be as long so I want it smaller then I had to make the snapchat smaller so one of them wasn't bigger than the other and then I noticed well I put this I put the two icons um in the incorrect space so you guys can actually put it anywhere this is just how I set up mines now some people do this but you don't have to just write what your channel is going to be about I just picked some words I picked life beauty and I think pranks yes but my channel is obviously not about this my actual banner that I made has a lot more things on there than those three and I just chose the font, but then I decided I don't want to have the same font as my channel name. So I will eventually change that. As you can see, I think that's what I'm about to do. Or I wanted that to be bigger than my channel's name, so that's what I did. And centered it. And I do I I do want the words a bit close so that it won't cut any of them off when I put the banner on my channel, which I won't actually use this banner because it was just for a video. But if you do that, you might want your words to be close, not as spaced out, because it will, it might cut some of the words off. And what you just saw was I just saved the image, and of course, another ad popped up. So now what I'm going to do is go there and that is my finished product.